everyone. Hello and welcome to your 15 minute pole workout. So this workout is going to have, of course, the pole. We're going to be doing five exercises and each exercise we're going to do three times. All right. So this is going to get you not only prepped for pole and conditioning, but also getting into some of our pole tricks and movements as well. All right, so let's get started. So the first one that we're gonna be doing with the pole, your hands are going to be about shoulder height. Step the feet about hip distance apart or a little bit wider. And then we're doing a chest stretch, inhale down. And then exhale, roll it up. Inhale down, exhale, roll it up. Driving the chest down. And you'll feel that stretch through the center of the back as well as through the legs, hamstring. For three, two, and one. Very good. All right, we're gonna step the feet now close in towards the pole. The hands will stay at same thing about chest height. We're doing a row. So inhale, arms extend, and then pull it in. From here, you can make this one more challenging by stepping the feet past the pole, down, and pull in. You're squeezing into your back. And keep the body nice and straight like a plank. Good for three, two, one, squeeze it at the top, and come out. All right, very good. Let's come to the back of the pole. From here, hands again, just about in front of the face. We're gonna hop the feet out into a squat, and then back up to the center. So, little jump squat, use the pole. So think of pulling as you jump back up. Good, for three, two, and one. All right, good work. So the next exercise that we're going to do, we're gonna step over to one side. Your inside arm is coming into your bicep. Outside hand on top, coming into our setup for any invert or tuck and fan kick. So for today, we're gonna to do similar to our fan kicks. Inside leg goes around, and then the outside leg will tuck. Inside leg around, outside leg tuck. So this one is working on our hip mobility, as well as our core. You wanna try and maintain that inside hip on the pole the whole time. On this last one, we're turning it over and switching sides. Inside arm wraps, other hand comes on top. Inside leg rotates, other leg tuck. Inside, tuck. When you do that tuck, try and face that inside corner. Two more. And one, very nice. All right, from here, we're gonna be doing our pole squats. Walk the back to the pole, walk the feet forward. And squat down, hold. Belly button pulls in towards the spine. Try and get the knees and hips in line. Strong breath. Three, two, one, bring it up. All right, everyone, so here we go again. This is our second round. So between each round of exercises, we have our 30 second break. All right, let's get set up. Hands are about chest height. Step the feet wide, a little wider than the hips. Inhale down, 
Exhale, roll it up. There's a little pull on the way up. So you're articulating through your back. So inhale, keep the legs almost just a little straight, bend a little bit in the knees, bring your chest, and then press down, roll it up. On the way up, squeeze through your butt. Four, three, two, and one. Good. From there, walk those feet in. Hands are still about chest tight. You can walk the heels past the pole and extend and pull in. Good, for four, three, two, one. Squeeze it at the top, feel your back, and let it go. All right, coming to the back of the pole. Hands are about head height. When you're ready, hop it out into a jump squat, and back. Use both the arms. And the legs, when you hop it out, the toes can be pointing slightly out to the side. Make sure you're sitting back. For two, and one. Good, all right. Now we're gonna to come to the right hand side. Your left arm on the inside, hold. Other hand comes on top. I'm feeling it, hope you are too. All right, from here. Walk it forward. We're going inside leg rotates, other leg tuck. Rotate, tuck. And if this knee needs to bend, that's okay. Breathe. Try and rotate the whole body towards that corner, tuck. Last three, two, and one. Good, from there, turn it around, and we're gonna continue on the other side. Inside arm, other hand comes over. You are squeezing that elbow inwards, using your armpit, bicep to hold. From here, inside leg, over and tuck. Over and tuck. Inhale, exhale, tuck. Inhale, exhale, tuck. Last three, two, and one. Very nice, turn it all around. Very nice everyone, we got one more here. Before we finish this round, walk it forward. Back is right up against the pole, belly button towards the spine. Bring it down. So these are isometric holds when we're holding a position really feeling it in our, so the muscles are burning, but at the same time we're stabilizing too. Stabilizing through our core as well as through the legs. Here we go, guys, we got four, three, two, and one. Good work, all right, 30 seconds. So this is similar to an interval training workout. So should feel that you are definitely getting your heart rate elevated, the body is warm. This can be a routine or a circuit that you do before doing some actual pole tricks or pole training. So to introduce the next round of videos and how we're going to work it, I'm gonna be putting out a new video every Wednesday and I'm going to be woo, alternating between an intense or a interval workout like this with the pole, and then also a tricks workout as well. All right, when you're ready, hands in front, walk it back. Inhale down and up. Good, sit the hips back. Still using your core here. Roll it up. Inhale back, 
So you should feel lengthening on the way back of the backs of the legs, squeezing on the way up. Down and up for two and one. Good. Now walk it forward. Hands in front, bow chest tight. Walk it in, or walking it into a, your row. Out and squeeze. Good work, we got three, two, and one. Squeeze it at the top, and then let it go. Good, good. All right, let's take it to the back. Hands in front, pop it out when you're ready. Out and in. Get nice and low as you squat. Inhale down, exhale left. Four, three, two, and one. Good, all right, we got a couple more here. Inside arm wraps, other hand comes over. Squeezing through that arm. Inside leg goes around, other one tucks, tuck. Around and tuck. Around, tuck, round, tuck. Round, tuck, round, tuck. Three, two, and one, turn it all the way, and face, or come to the other side. Other hand on top, ready from here. We have inside leg around, and tuck, tuck. Use those abs, inhale, exhale, tuck. Drive that knee into your chest. Inhale, exhale, three, two, and one, Woo. good, take it all around. Very nice everyone, last time with our wall squat or pole squat, walk it back, backs against the pole, feet walk forward, drop it down. Challenge yourself here, we're only holding it for a short time. Get low, make sure your knees are pointing straight over the toes. Bracing through the center. Let's go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Yes! Very nice, everyone. We're going to do a little shakedown to cool it out. So you can walk in place, shake out the ankles, the legs, maybe the wrists and the forearms. The next video will be a trick video. So this will be similar to like tutorials. I'll be putting a few tricks together somewhere always between about three and five that will go into a short sequence. These will be progressive for all levels. Thank you so much. Let's do a big inhale, reach up, and exhale, let it go. Feel free to continue with any of the stretching videos and any of our splits, conditioning, anything like that as you want to progress throughout our time together. I'll see you next week.